We all know ads by famous beer brands featuring sexy women wearing nothing but a tiny bikini. So three women in Brazil started to feel uncomfortable because of this, and I agree. So I'm very happy they've created the feminist beer. Hi Maria, welcome. Um, why do we need a feminist beer? Uh, Brazil is a very sexist country and ads here are also very sexist, especially the beer ads. They use our bodies to sell products without any kind of respect, as if, only, uh, as if women were only here to serve men and like women don't even drink it. It, it. This is very untrue since we like to drink beer over here. And for the carnival, there are a lot of beer commercials. It's a very special time for them. So one brand did a billboard saying that we should forget the no at home. With carnival is the time of the year the most women in Brazil get raped. So it was really, really, really bad. And two girls that I don't know, but I really do admire a lot, they did an intervention saying that, oh, so forget the no at home, and we brought the never. They wrote it at the billboard, and it was amazing. And so that was why we decided to create the feminist beer. And is bringing a, a feminist beer on the market the solution to this? Oh, yes, I think so, because beer in Brazil is also seen as a conversation starter. It's something that you put on the table and you start talking about anything else around it. So if you put a, a beer that is called Feminista, you can start talking about feminist and discussing it because Brazil needs to talk about it as soon as possible uh, because every 90, 90 minutes a woman dies in Brazil because of sexism and just because she's a woman. So we need to talk about it. Definitely. Do you yeah. think men will drink this beer as well? Uh, I think so. They are already drinking with us and they are already talking with us about it. So it, we are about equal rights, you know. We don't want to be best than anyone. We just want to have what is right and we are equal. So it tastes good, so good as well? Yeah, it's a very strong and dark head ale. Uh, so now men can say that women just like to drink light beer or fruity beer. So now we have a head ale. Okay, thank you very much uh, for all your information and I really like it. If you guys want to know more about feminist beer, check out the article below.